Okay. and Sarah need to talk to you. Uh, yeah, hey, I'm here. You sound kind of cheerful. I had a breakthrough. Look, all I needed was that DNA sequencer. I'm ready to test it. Deacon, I'm ready to test my serum. Wow. Okay. Um, what do you need from me? I'll tell you when you get here. Sarah, out. Corporal St. John. Come on, this shit? This is some primo shit, let me tell you. Okay, yeah. Every little bit helps, yeah? Well, yeah, it makes sense. I'd do that if I had enough credits, you know? Credit burning a hole in your man first, or what? There you go. Yeah, okay. Corporal St. John, I'll see you around, yeah? A few weeks back, we were riding west along the old Belknap Road. And there was a bunch of crazy assholes, almost naked, all scarred up. Copy that, Captain. St. John out.
just need this. had trouble concentrating. A can of fuel. Another Nero micro recorder. Hmm. How much fuel we got? I'm not sure. Uh, I enough to get back to base. Okay. Why? Right, what's up? What are you thinking? Well, I was thinking about checking the traps over by Thielsen. Oh man, that's way out of our range. Put it on the roster for tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. what I can do. It's Corporal St. John. Open up. Corporal St. John. Hello, Sergeant. Oh, okay. Otsukaresama, <laughs> Corporal. Oh, I'm just gonna close my eyes for a bit. How's my favorite corporal doing today? Hello, Sergeant. Nope. Okay. Corporal St. John. I'll catch you later. Deacon. Good. I've got an important mission for you. That's why I'm here, sir. A group of marauders has been attacking supply lines on our southern border. I've marked their position on your map. We think they're using a network of caves south of Crater Lake as their base of operations. Caves? Okay. I don't have enough resources available for a full-on assault. So you want me to go in, quiet, 
and take him out. I'll leave the details up to you, Corporal. Dismissed. Okay. Here we go. Never gets old. Raiders, huh? Going after little venison, huh? Tired of killing drifters? Yeah, I see that. Ooh! Supply lines, right just here. where you said they'd be. Corporal St. John, good. Do you need assistance? Fuck me! So, uh, what, what were you saying? Good luck, Corporal. Curry out. So you boys thought you'd just set up camp and pick off the militia supply runs. Say it! You gotta know, life's not that easy. Caves, huh? So now we're see ya, turning asshole. into a bunch of all of them. Okay, yeah, they're done. Corporal St. John, the Diamond Lake, come in. Corporal. Captain, those marauders on our southern border have been uh, neutralized. You said I'm... Uh, sir? You were a drifter for a long time, St. John. Sometimes it takes a while for a new recruit to accept their position as part of a greater force. Frankly, I didn't know if you could do it. Uh, well, hey, I'm in the army now. Yes. Yes, you are. Dismiss, Corporal. Uh, yes, sir. St. John out.
Safety! Corporal in command. Ho! Oh, and it goes for the upgrade. Nice. Yeah, gonna make me a quadrillionaire, right? <laughs> Cheap in buying a new one, right? Come on, am I right? Huh? Oh, okay. Come on, this shit? This is some primo shit, let me tell you. There you go. Yeah, okay. Corporal St. John. I'll see you around, yeah? Corporal St. John. Sarge, good to see you. <laughs> see you, Sarge. Have a good one. Oh, big spender. Huh? Ah, okay. See you, Corporal. Deacon, uh, Corporal St. John. Good to see you, man. Hey, Sergeant. Okay, got it. Okay. Corporal St. John, a Deke. See you around. Hold up. You want one alive? Oh, kind of hard to run tests on something dead. Here. What, what is that? It's a special tranquilizer. It'll help you knock it out long enough so you can bring it back here. I am so close, Deacon. This could be it. Yes, ma'am. Hey, I was just heading out to find you a newt. Great. Okay, there's a specific one that I need, all right? Oh, wait, hold on for a second. A specific newt? South of here, just off Rim Drive, is an old resort cabin. It's now home to an entire colony of infected kid. Newts. Okay. Okay, so radio me when you get there. Sarah, out. Colony of Newts, oh my god, this I gotta see. St. John, report. Hey, Captain. I'm on a run for Lieutenant Whitaker, so I'm kinda busy at the moment. Understood. Report to me when you're finished. We're ready to test Weaver's weapon. Hurry out. <laughs> Shit. Oh, so much for Sarah beating Weaver to the finish line. Sir, I'm here. Alright, you're looking for a young female wearing a red shirt. One of those kids' shirts that says, like, Teensy Tabby or something. I'm surprised the Colonel hasn't burned this place out yet. I told Matt the site was hands-off. I've been running blood tests on several of the youngest ones for months. I need them for the serum. Okay, uh, how am I supposed to get the one that you want without killing the rest? Look, I don't know, just... Just do what you have to do, okay? I need the female wearing the red shirt. Boundies.
Fucking Jesus Christ. Uh, hey, Captain, uh, pistol over my bike. Uh, yeah, the Colonel doesn't allow for pets on the island, I'm afraid. <laughs> uh, Lieutenant needed a live test subject. Uh, you two seem to be getting along well. You and Lieutenant Whitaker? Just doing my job, sir. You know, keep it professional, Corporal. The Colonel doesn't allow for fraternization between enlisted men and officers. Oh, no, no. It can't have any of that, sir. Carry on. Yes, sir. <coughs> okay. <sighs> Come on, help me! Come on! Come on. <sighs> so much for your tranquilizer. Yeah, well, their biology's kind of fucked right now. What do you want me to do? I can't get the right dosage. Here, hold on, hold on. <laughs> what I've been working on. How long? Oh, hold on, just a few seconds. Oh, shit. What you put in that. That shit went down fast. Damn it! <laughs> but you're, you're, you're not making a bioweapon. You're. Oh my god, are you, are you, are you trying to cure it? I thought. Once I got the original cell line from Cloverdale that I could create antibodies for the virus and I could reverse engineer it. Jesus. And now all of that work, everything that I have worked on is for nothing. I can't save them. Nothing's gonna be able to change them back. So get up, dust yourself off, try again. Were you not seeing what just happened? Every cell in that kid's body just exploded. That's exactly why you can't quit. What? Because you called it a kid. Do you have any idea how many of these things that I've killed? And it never once occurred to me, you know what, that used to be someone's kid. 
You know, I met this girl once, and she used to talk about the freakers the same way you do. She used to call them sick people. I thought that was crazy, but she looks at them the same way that you do. So you think I'm crazy? No, no. I think you're the first sane person I've seen in two years. You know, I still remember the night that I lost you, but I'm starting to realize it wasn't the night that I had left you on that chopper. It was the next night. Me and Boozer, we rode into that refugee camp that you were supposed to be waiting at, right? Except there's freakers everywhere. The choppers are on fire. There's people screaming, so many people. And so we fought, and we won, and what did we get? Bodies. Bodies everywhere. And I checked every corpse, every face. There must have been a thousand of them, maybe more. I checked every single one. That was the night that I lost you. And Boozer. Boozer, you know, he's, <laughs> he's just, he was just trying to keep me together for the next two years. But I didn't give a shit about any of it. And then I see this Nero chopper flying around in the sky, and I start to feel something. I'm thinking, you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you. Because even if she is alive, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to find her. We're going to ride away. We're never going to look back. Because I don't want to be part of some militia. I don't want to fight in a war, and I don't want to live in some camp. So why are you still here? Because of you. All of this, seeing how hard you work, seeing how dedicated you are. Most people out there, they're just trying to survive, and here you are. Trying to save the goddamn world. Yeah, well, I'm not doing a very good job. So you get up. You dust yourself off, and you try again. We're going back to Cloverdale. They got better equipment. We're going to dig into their research deeper. You would do that. You would help me. Yeah, I would. I would because you believe in this. We'll ride north. Yeah, we'll ride north. We'll, we'll tell them that we're going on a supply run. Yeah, but we're not coming back. No, we're gonna go AWOL. You know if they catch us, they will hang us. Then we hang together. Ma'am? <clears throat> yeah? Deke, Colonel wants to see you. Be right there. Pack up what you need, I'll be back. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Corporal St. John. Colonel, sir. Come with me, please. Are we ready? Colonel, sir. Yes, sir. That shit is locked and loaded. Uh, bike's already loaded, sir. I'm not sure if I understand. Lieutenant Weaver's weapon is finished. We're ready to test it. Hell yeah. Are you ready to burn down a horde? Oh. Something wrong, Corporal? No, sir. No, no, no. Um, hell yeah. Let's get this done. All right. Now you're talking, man. Gentlemen, this is the start of a new era. Carry on. Lieutenant Weaver, with me. Yes, sir. All right. I figure that I think we should... you should stay up here and let me do this alone. What the fuck? You got a death wish? No. That's why I think I should go in alone. Look, even with Weaver's jacked up Molotovs, we can't take an entire horde all at once. No. So, uh, all right, I figure I go down there. I get their attention. I pull off a few at a time, and then I run like hell. And I gotta find some way to slow them down, maybe set a few traps. And then I blow them to hell. Look, two of us running around down there. It's gonna be chaos. We'll just pull the horde down on each other. No, you stay up here. You keep an eye on me. Shit goes south. You ride in there, you get me the hell out. Hmm? Unless you got a better plan. 
I got nothing. <laughs> I've got more Molotovs. Ammo in my saddlebags. Good, good. Uh, shit's gonna come in handy. Tell me your plan again. Like I said, find a way to slow them down. Those sons of bitches like to clump up, climb all over each other. If I can find a narrow space between trucks, buildings, whatever, it'll take them a while to get through. And once I get some space between me and them, you'll blow them the hell up. You got it. Rinse, repeat, uh, a few times. No more horde. That's your plan. <sighs> That's my plan. Good luck, St. John. Fox got nothing to do with it. All right, I'm heading in. I see you. Let me know if you need my help. <laughs> Copy that. Better idea.
St. John, there's a swarm on you. Yeah, I'm aware of that. all of them. I can't believe it. You did it. You wiped out an entire horde. Yeah, no problem. No problem. <laughs> Sarah, are you there? Uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, this is Corporal St. John reporting in. Come back. Now, oh, where the hell are you? We did it. You did it. Uh, we did it. Oh. I've never seen anything like this. I mean, the way you were one step ahead of them. Ever had a horde breathing down your neck? It really keeps the adrenaline flowing. Maybe the colonel's right. Maybe we can win this war. I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Oh, shit. It didn't work? Oh, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. But you're out of a job. Hell yeah, it worked. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> you should have been there, man. We really lit him up. Oh, man! We're gonna celebrate tonight. The office's mess. <laughs> All right. Looks like somebody's getting a promotion. Hey, man, you coming? Yeah. Uh, you know what? Let me, I'm gonna catch up. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta take care of something first. All right, you handle that. That's the last of it. Be careful not to break anything. Some of these things are irreplaceable. What's going on? Uh, where is the lieutenant? Corporal St. John. I'm sorry, sir. It's all right, son. All essential personnel doing R&D have been moved. Moved? Where? Uh, because I need to deliver these supplies that she asked for. I understand. There's been a... Uh, Walk with me, son. 
please. Ma'am, Colonel's orders. Matt, you can't do this. You can't keep me locked in here. Please, Captain. And then the Lord said to Noah, Enter the ark, you and all your household. For you alone I have seen to be righteous before me in this time. Matt, what are you talking about? I'm sorry, you, Lieutenant. You can't! Colonel, wait! Hey! It's fine. It's fine. Ma'am, I got the uh, supplies that you asked for. Come on in. Follow me. I've been working on a new assignment. Poison this time. Listen. When you pick this, you have to do it carefully. If you don't, it could kill you. Understood. I'm gonna get you out of here. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. St. John. I'm here, Kevin. The Colonel has asked to see you. You'll find him in his chambers inside the Ark. His chambers? If you go in from the main camp, past the first storage area, there's a passage off to the left. Okay, uh, any idea what he wants? Something about a duty roster. Don't keep him waiting, Corporal. No, sir. Your name has been mentioned for an important project coming up. Keep your nose clean, and there might be a promotion in your future. Yes, sir. Korea. Important project. What project? 